If you like our video, click the button to subscribe to our channel and get easy access to new content. To see our full suite of ad-free video courses, instruction manuals, and quick reference guides, visit us at www.teachucomp.com. To format a selected picture in Publisher, use the buttons on the Picture Format Contextual tab in the ribbon. To insert new pictures in Publisher, click the Pictures button in the Insert button group on the Picture Format Contextual tab of the ribbon to open the Insert Pictures window. Then use this window to insert local pictures from your computer or online pictures by making the desired selections. To apply picture corrections to a selected picture in Publisher, click the Corrections button in the Adjust button group on the Picture Format Contextual tab of the ribbon. Then select a preset picture correction in the drop down menu that appears. Alternatively, to manually apply advanced picture correction settings within the Picture tab of the Format Picture dialog box, Select the Picture Corrections Options command at the bottom of the Corrections Buttons drop down menu. To recolor a selected picture in Publisher, click the Recolor drop down button in the Adjust button group on the Picture Format Contextual tab of the ribbon. Then select one of the many preset coloring tints to apply. To select a different coloring tint to apply, roll over the More Variations command in the Recolor Buttons drop-down menu, and then select a choice from the palette of colors that appears. To compress pictures in a publication, select the pictures to compress if desired. Then click the Compress Pictures button in the Adjust button group on the Picture Format Contextual tab of the ribbon to open the Compress Pictures dialog box. In the Compress Pictures dialog box, set your desired compression options using the checkboxes and option buttons. Then, click the Compress button in the dialog box to finish and compress the pictures. To either change or remove a selected picture in Publisher, Click the Change Picture button in the Adjust button group on the Picture Format Contextual tab of the ribbon. To then select a new picture, click the Change Picture command from the Buttons drop-down menu to open the Insert Pictures window where you can select an alternative picture. Alternatively, to remove the selected picture but leave its placeholder, choose the Remove Picture command from the Buttons drop-down menu. To reset all changes made to a selected picture in Publisher, click the Reset Picture button in the Adjust button group on the Picture Format Contextual tab of the ribbon. To swap two selected pictures in Publisher so they will trade location or formatting, select the two pictures to swap. To swap the selected picture's locations, then directly click the Swap button in the Swap button group on the Picture Format Contextual tab of the ribbon. Alternatively, to only swap the formatting between the two selected pictures, click the drop down below the Swap button, and then select the Swap Formatting Only command from the Buttons drop down menu. To apply a preset picture style to a selected picture in Publisher, click to select a picture style in the large scroll box in the Picture Styles button group on the Picture Format contextual tab of the ribbon. To format a selected picture's border in Publisher, 
Click the Picture Border drop-down button in the Picture Styles button group on the Picture Format Contextual tab of the ribbon. The formatting options for a selected Pictures Border in Publisher are the same as for a selected Shapes Outline in Publisher, which we just examined in the previous lesson titled Formatting Shapes, so we will not review them here again for brevity's sake. To apply a picture effect to a selected picture in Publisher, click the Picture Effects drop-down button in the Picture Styles button group on the Picture Format Contextual tab of the ribbon. Then, roll over a type of picture effect to apply grouped by category in the Buttons drop-down menu. Then click to apply a variant of the selected effect category in the side menu that appears. To apply a caption to a selected picture in Publisher, click the Caption drop-down button in the Picture Styles button group on the Picture Format Contextual tab of the ribbon. In the drop-down menu that then appears, click the Caption Style you like to apply it to the picture. To move all selected pictures in a publication in Publisher into the scratch area and arrange them as thumbnail images, click the Arrange Thumbnails button in the Arrange button group on the Format Picture contextual tab of the ribbon. To select a text wrapping style to apply to a selected picture in Publisher, Click the Wrap Text drop-down in the Arrange button group on the Picture Format contextual tab of the ribbon and select a choice from the drop-down. To change the order in which selected pictures overlap each other in a page in Publisher, click either the Bring Forward or Send Backward drop-down button in the same button group. To align selected pictures in Publisher, click the Align button in the Arrange button group on the Shape Format contextual tab of the ribbon, and then choose an Alignment option in the menu of choices that appears. To group multiple selected objects like pictures together as a single unit, click the Group button in the same button group. To split a grouped object back into its individual object components, click the Ungroup button. To rotate a selected picture in Publisher, click the Rotate button in the same button group and then select a rotation option from the drop down menu that appears. To crop a selected picture in Publisher, Directly click the Crop button in the Format tab of the Picture Tools Contextual tab. Then, click and drag inward using any of the cropping handles that appear on the picture's border. Alternatively, to crop a picture to a shape, click the drop down under the Crop button, roll over the Crop to Shape command, and then select a shape from the side menu that appears. If needed, then use the cropping handles on the shape or picture border to adjust the size of either as desired. To toggle whether the picture fits or fills the new cropping border size, click either the Fit or Fill button in the Crop button group as desired.
to clear the cropping border if desired. Click the Clear Crop button in the Crop button group. To apply the cropping after setting the new cropping border of the picture, click the Crop button again. Alternatively, to cancel the crop, Press the Escape key on your keyboard. Separately, to correct an applied cropping mistake in Publisher, click the Undo button in the Quick Access Toolbar. To change the height or width of a selected picture in Publisher, use the spinner arrows at the right end of either the height or width spinners in the Size button group on the Picture Format Contextual tab of the ribbon. Optionally, to make specific sizing changes to the picture by using the Size tab of the Format Picture dialog box, click the Size dialog box launcher button in the lower right corner of the Size button group, then make your changes in the Size tab of the Format Picture dialog box as desired, and then click the OK button to apply them. Remember to click the subscribe button to see more of our videos. See our full suite of courses, instruction manuals, and quick reference guides at www.teachucomp.com.